What's up everyone? This is Duran over at Alpha 7 Trading Academy here with another trade of the day. Uh, lately we've been having a very dry market and uh, so we have to take what we can but we have to be very picky. So I'm looking at CVX here for a 1 minute inverse pop and a 5 minute uh, inverse pop following with convergence uh, along with the 1 hour inverse pop. That's what I'm really looking at here. Um, so we got in, we're short. Our first target is going to be the bottom Bollinger Band of the one minute. So it's around 102.35, somewhere around that level. Or 45, that is. Now we can see that SPY is pretty tight and it's completely apathetic to our uh, stock. And what basically that means is that it's diverged from the correlation of uh, the overall market and it's moving on its own behalf. Uh, so we partialed out some here. Now our 5MA is the trailing stop and this is probably mainly due to the spies right here trying to push up. So the next bumper, we're going to cover our rest. There we go. We're going to cover the rest. Here we go. There you go. Right there. And, and with, with this being said, we took about uh, 15 to 20 cents on the downside. All right. Uh, allowed us to take 20 cents around 10.30, still in the micro wet climate, still in the uh, early stages before lunchtime, there's still volatility here. Um, and that's it. Now, if you wanted to, you could still hold the partial and use the 5MA as your trailing stop. However, I got out uh, because it already touched the 5-minute bottom Bollinger Band and the 15-minute bottom Bollinger Band. So. I decided to close it early and take what I could get. So let's see how it plays, if it rejects or if it breaks. So remember we made about 15, 20 cents there. Let's see if it breaks down. It does have a counter candle here. Still holding the five. Now SPY is coming down. And there we go. So we're out and uh, about 20 cents on CVX. That's for the trade of the day. Have a great day, guys.